Hello and welcome to another special Process Love Candy. My name is Mark Sheard and in today's session we're going to be drawing hands again. I've got eight new hand poses ready to draw in this quick fire 30 second life drawing session so get those pens and pencils ready and get set to do some gesture drawing. Today's quick tips is brought to you by the letter I. <laughs> As in I need to tell you something about tapering your line work. This is something that you can do with speed and it's about when you put your pen to the page. If you start with your pen to the page and then start drawing, you will always start with a blunt edge. You won't get that nice tapered line work. But if you start already moving your hand and then you touch the page down and then stroke and then lift off, but you keep your hand moving that whole time, you'll get a nice tapered stroke on either end. The same goes for when you end. You might be able to taper at the start and then you stop on the dime and then lift your pen from the page and that will end up with a full stop on the end of your line and you'll have a flat blunt edge. Uh, these blunt edges can be good if that's what you want. They are very bold and they will stand out. It's worth having a practice before we get into today's session so you might want to pause the video for a little bit and just practice doing a few different strokes and who knows, you might get better drawings out now because of this. All right, let's get ready for our first hand of the day. It is palm outstretched. How's my lifeline looking? <laughs> let's get that little finger out the side. I like the way that that's going out. of chicken scratching on this. Last week I said not to do it and here I am doing it. <laughs> ah, there we go. There's my hand, my first hand of the day. I hope that was a nice little warm up for you. It's good to get into it and get started. Let's get a new layer ready and get ready for our next drawing. Let's see what hand pose we got. Ready? fingers just nestled in under there. Let's get that thumb happening. And those creases kind of important. And I am out of time but I'm just going to draw that in and there's my pointing hand. <laughs> I went a bit crazy with my poses and, and did a bit of uh, exaggeration there but I think that came out pretty fun and exciting. down first and I love the way the knuckles all just lay over each other they're like perfectly combined to go one on top of the other let's get that big thumb in right. my 30 seconds down just got to finish off those last little bits and there's my wonky fist <laughs> getting lots of wonky drawings today how are your drawings turning out it's wonky like mine wonky's all right wonky's just a bit of fun <laughs> today let's get a new layer how are you guys going today I hope everyone's doing well let's get ready for another one okay this one's a bit of a tough one 
playing with the fingers going in different directions. Um, I can use those creases of the digits to help push that, show the direction they're going. I like this. It's a good, good way to loosen up and uh, really get fresh. And there's no pressure to do a good job. You just got to have fun and, and practice and get better. Repetition. It's all about that. All right, a bit of force, more force action. It's like casting a spell. Let's get that finger up there. Oh, my fingers are all getting really thin on this one. <laughs> that was a bit of fun. Less chicken scratching on that one, more just big bold lines, so I like it. Fun. Right, no. Only a few more left. Let's see what's next. Alright, let's get going. Are we ready for another drawing? Get set. sometimes tough because they don't have as much definition to follow but we can take our time a little bit more with this one because there's not as much to draw um, which can be a hindrance sometimes switching Lumpy fist. <laughs> How's your fist looking? Pretty lumpy like mine? <laughs> okay, let's get ready for another drawing. Very last one of the session. I hope you've been having fun. I have been. Let's get ready. And here we go. Oh, this one's going to be tough right up. Into the camera, getting that shapes. Tough on something like right in the camera. Let's use those separators to help show the direction of that. Pull in that a little bit more. There's my 30 seconds done, but I'm just going to push it a little bit just to get the rest of that arm done. There we go. So thank you for joining me today in this quick fire gesture drawing session. I hope you've enjoyed drawing these hands with me. You've been hanging out with Shido and this has been Ace. <laughs> I'll catch you later guys. Bye.